the Ukrainian-made system for informing the location of Russian troops builds its communication around the Starlink and allows to inflict serious blows on Russian troops. The enemy positions can already be fired upon within 30 seconds of receiving the request. The automated GIS Arta command and control system, which the creators themselves call Uber for artillery, combines information from drones, GPS, satellite photos, altitude maps, ammunition data in Ukrainian army units, and is a very effective tool for planning, control, processing, and dispatching of the results of reconnaissance operations, which allows for quick identification and destruction of selected targets. The application was created by Ukrainian developers in 2015, and the military welcomed it with open arms. Can this system be compared to Uber? Yes, because the innovative situational awareness system works on the same principle as the travel ordering service, which connects the passenger with the nearest driver, only the GIS Arta system connects military targets with the nearest artillery, mortar, missile units and combat drones. When a reconnaissance unit or drone patrolling a given area notices an enemy, it transmits its location to the system, similar to what a passenger does in the Uber application. After processing this data, the control system selects the most optimal method of firing, informing the nearest artillery crew, mortar units or drones. Once the headquarters confirms the target, it will be destroyed by targeted shots within 30 seconds. The source of data for the system is information provided by reconnaissance drones, rangefinders, smartphones, GPS and radars provided to NATO by Ukraine. Then the algorithms decide on their own which weapon is to be sent to a given place to increase the effectiveness of the attack. By comparison, a similar US system takes 30 minutes from notification to shelling, although the Pentagon is more accurate in verifying targets. Moreover, the shelling is carried out from multiple directions, unlike the traditional shelling used by the Russian army. Instead of firing from standard artillery batteries located in one place, the attack is more like a swarm of shells coming from almost everywhere. In addition, the GIS Arta system is able to calculate when a projectile or missile from each unit will hit the target and coordinate the attack from different positions so that they hit the target almost simultaneously. This greatly complicates the Russian counterattack. The most interesting thing is that the GIS Arta system works perfectly with old, even Soviet models of 152mm artillery installations, as well as with state-of-the-art 155mm NATO howitzers. They are now the most effective weapons in all areas of the front, destroying enemy tanks, infantry fighting vehicles, armored vehicles and enemy manpower. Of course, an internet connection is required for the GIS Arta system to work. The Russian military knew in advance about the Ukrainian system, so with the onset of the invasion, they launched a massive cyber attack on Tuway, a provider of civilian satellite internet, paralyzing the Ukrainian combat system. And then Elon Musk, who developed the Starlink system a few years ago, the technology belongs to SpaceX, which works in the aerospace industry, entered the arena. Starlink is a set of satellites designed for broadband internet access anywhere in the world. This is exactly what is needed in a war, when a normal network infrastructure becomes the target for the enemy in the first place. From the very beginning of the war, an American businessman suggested that Ukraine use Starlink. Unlike with other types of communications, Russia is unable to hack the communication system from Mask, so GIS Arta can work smoothly to provide a tactical advantage to the military. The accuracy of the target's coordinates is very high, with an error of 6 to 25 meters, which in the artillery field means that targets will almost always be hit. In fact, the system can prioritize and calculate firing parameters for all types and means of fire damage. Finally, another advantage of the Ukrainian GIS Arta tracking system is that it can automatically map, for example, schools, hospitals and other civilian objects, and locate its own military units. This makes it possible to send a signal to the military with a command to change position if they fall into the line of fire. The events of recent days have shown that the Ukrainian armed forces are able not only to defend themselves but also to counterattack effectively, inflicting devastating blows on the enemy.